Russian diplomat warns of right to counterattack in Ukraine. The Russian ambassador to the EU has said that if Moscow felt the need to safeguard Russian people in eastern Ukraine, it would be within its rights to launch a counterattack. Given that a false flag operation has been indicated as a crucial option by Western intelligence, the statements in an interview with The Guardian will do nothing to soothe the worries of a big Russian attack on Ukraine. Since 2014, the Kremlin has armed and sponsored an insurgency in the Donbas area of eastern Ukraine. Russian passports have also been distributed in recent years to persons living in two so-called People's Republics that are no longer under the sovereignty of Kiev. Since 2014, the war has claimed the lives of around 14,000 individuals. Despite substantial evidence to the contrary, Russia has long denied involvement in the war. Chizhov warned that a rapid escalation of the situation in the Donbas area, or a Ukrainian provocation, might lead to Russian military intervention. Provocations like those described by Chizhov are allegedly being planned by Moscow, according to US officials. They claim to have proof of a plot to construct a very gory, phony film depicting a Ukrainian assault. Over the weekend, U.S. intelligence sources claimed that Russia had advanced planning for an invasion and may begin deploying forces into Ukraine on Wednesday, with an estimated 145,000 Russian soldiers on the border. Russia's foreign minister, Sergei Lavrov, seemed to keep the door open for more talks with Russian President Vladimir Putin on Monday.